Hello, my Libra loves. Look at you on the bottom of the deck. I ain't even shuffled yet. The Empress. Hello, my Libra loves. How you guys doing? Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for coming through, clicking on the video. Welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning viewer or subscriber, welcome back, all right? This message is for Libras, okay? Someone rising Venus or anywhere that you have Libra in your chart, you may resonate with this reading. Cross watchers, what's up? I see you. Y'all know we're just going to go ahead and hop into the messages, see what comes out, what Holy Spirit wants you guys to know at this time, what your guardian angels, ancestors, what the messages are for you at this time, okay? Please remember that these will be general, okay? These messages are not for everybody. However, if you were guided to this reading, then there may be a message here for you, all right? Also, masculine and feminine energies can be switched. Roles can be reversed as it applies to your situation. I could also be picking up on past, present, and future energy. Hmm. My right ear just started ringing, and then I felt like a... Uh, a breeze, okay? I'm hearing Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael. Some I mean, you could be dealing with the Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Sagittarius, or Leo. Capricorn or Aries. I'm hearing Dustin or Destin. Destiny. Clinton. Clinton. Okay. Messages for Libra. If you guys need um to book a personal. Any information that you need will be in the description box, okay, guys? Please email me before you send any payments, okay? For Libra, or the messages we need to know at this time. I mean, it's something about a conundrum, <laughs> okay? Somebody's baffled about some information that they found out or will find out. Okay, this guy has something to do with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius here with the fire sign. Yeah, heavy on the fire energy. Okay, so somebody's going to be baffled or like astounded or shocked by some information that they find out. Okay, this could be you finding out information about a fire sign or there's a fire sign who was finding out some type of information about you. Okay, or hearing something about you, somebody could be saying something about you, let telling this person something about you. Okay, I'm also hearing uh, you're tougher than you look, Libra. Okay, somebody didn't expect you to bounce back the way you did, or something like that. Okay, somebody may be hearing that you're doing really well here. Okay, yeah, Queen of Wands on the bottom. It's like you're looking good, you're smelling good, you're feeling good, okay? You're feeling yourself, 333 three, three on the timer. Other people are feeling you, you're happy, okay? You're stable. Yeah, mm-hmm, Ace of Swords. Somebody's finding out something about you or something's coming to the light here about something. Hmm. Some of you may be learning a new skill, or you're doing some type of, you're learning something, or some of you may be like going back to school, taking classes or something like that, okay? I'm hearing something about jelly. Gelatin, I don't know, somebody eating jello? What the fuck? <laughs> somebody may be making jello, maybe you gotta cook something. I'm getting like jello shots, something about jello shots. Shout out, I don't know. All right, so Ten of Swords, you got the betrayal here. Okay, there was some type of betrayal, maybe in a relationship or a partnership. There was a betrayal between two people. I feel like something, there's going to be some type of clarity coming out about this, okay? Somebody's going to be finding out some type of truth about uh, a person who betrayed them or backstabbed them, okay? Yeah, you may be shocked to find out who this is or something like that. Maybe shocked to find out that something is coming to an ending here, okay, with somebody. Okay, Ace of Coins. 
Ace of what? Kawans. Ace of Kawans. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. Okay. Ciao. All right, new beginning. Somebody, somebody could be getting a new beginning, new job, new opportunity. For some of you, you could be starting a new business or your business is going well, okay? The Ace of Coins also talks about um, it talks about um, abundance. It talks about new opportunities and things like that. But it also could talk about a new person. All right. But maybe we'll see. But Queen of Coins energy. I feel like you're you're sitting in some very stable energy. That's why I'm saying somebody didn't expect you to bounce back or they're surprised that you're doing as well as you're doing or something like that. OK, maybe they're surprised because whatever betrayal that they did or sabotage or whatever the hell it was, maybe they're surprised that it didn't work and that you bounced back. And so if somebody was trying to, you know, do something to hold you back or like to destroy your business or your image or something like that, it's like it didn't work. So this person may be shocked to find that out. And you may also be finding out who this person is. Like somebody was actually really trying to betray you, sabotage you or set you up. I'm hearing. Okay. Um, you also have the Page of Swords here. The Page of Swords talks about, um, da -da -da -da, like, you know, watching, spying, things like that. It could also be talking about learning. There's somebody watching you do something, though, because this Page of Swords is looking up toward that Page of Wands. So you could be dealing with the energy of somebody who's younger than you. It doesn't have to be, but um, this could also have something to do with children. Maybe you're watching your children do something or learn something, but somebody's watching you do something or this could just be you learning or like a, once again like i said learning a new skill somebody is take, watching you do something though and like taking notes kind of you know what i'm saying like and you chilling nine of cups you're getting your wish fulfillment here like you're gonna like you're getting everything that you want it's almost like things are falling into place here even though this person tried to betray you or backstab you it's like it didn't work and you just chilling like you just floating on that cloud like ain't got a care in the world like unbothered untouched okay you got uh pisces aquarius energy virgo taurus capricorn out here some gemini leo aries sagittarius all right um hmm child queen of coins king of coins some of you guys are meeting a new person and this person is watching you and they're watching what you do there's somebody who is watching you libra and this person is like your counterpart soulmate yeah look justice child oh look ace of wands passionate new start new beginning oh look the will of fortune destiny things changing in your favor okay oh look page of wands i mean page of coins news coming in communication this could be um an offer okay from somebody this could be a, a younger person somebody could be younger than you oh look six of wands happiness victory this is a yes okay this could also be somebody um a public figure or somebody on a public platform or something like that or this could be you okay hmm libra somebody's watching you libra and they like what they see all right could be a counterpart for you with the queen of wands out here or or and with the i meant shit queen of coins because you're in this queen of coins energy and this king of coins here. If, if this this could be a counterpart, a soulmate or something like that, or this is just somebody who's on your level. Maybe you guys do the same thing, 844 on the timer here. So it's like, just say like this, like you have a platform like this, okay? Maybe you guys do the same thing. Maybe there's somebody who, you know, watches your videos, whatever it is that you do. Some of you could do like cooking videos or tutorials or whatever it is, okay? And, you know, some, somebody's watching you and you're catching their eye, Libra. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> Look, let me put this little king of coins out here, honey. Yeah, page of cups. Somebody wants to make you an offer. 919 on the timer. Child. They want to collab. This could be somebody who just wants to collaborate with you, work with you. This could be a business opportunity. Okay. Somebody may, may think that you're very good at what you do. They could want to collaborate with you to make some money. But I'm also getting like a power couple. All right. 939 on the timer. So... I don't know if this person just wants to collaborate with you because they feel like you're very skilled at what you do, okay? And again, like I said, you two could do the same things, okay? Um, Let's just see. What's the energy of this king of coins? This person who watching Libra, what's the energy of this king of coins? 
Why are they watching Libra? Damn. Ah! Five of coins fell on the floor and it's in the reverse. It, it fell upright, so I saw it land in the reverse. Five of coins talks about being left out in the cold. It's also talk could talk of um in the upright, it talks about being left out in the cold. It talks about uh, maybe going through a tough financial situation, but in the reverse here, I feel like that's not the case here, okay? Maybe this person is going to help you out of a tough financial situation, or maybe this, this person can show you how to elevate your business or whatever it is that you do, maybe bring in more coinage or more money. Once again, I am hearing power couple, okay? Tell me about this king of coins. Why are they watching Libra? Tell me about this king of coins. Somebody watching you. Ugh. Look at you on the bottom of the deck. Libra, the Empress. Wow, they're watching you. They see you as the Empress. They know you the Empress here. Eight of Wands, they want to come toward you. Queen of Wands, this person could be very, very attracted to you, okay, with the Hierophant. This could be somebody um, who also has a platform. Again, this could talk about a collaboration. I'm hearing something about, like, Discord, or um, like a group of people like working together and this person wants to bring you in on it, okay? For some of you, yeah, three of wands, they, they want to, mm -hmm. something's come to an end, some type of sorrow or worry or something like that. If this was you sitting in this energy, it's, that's coming to an end here, okay? Because you got an ending, a change, things are about to change for you, Libra. For a lot of y'all, well, I ain't gonna say for a lot of y'all, for whoever, for some of y'all, this is like a work business opportunity. For some of y'all, this is about love. For some of y'all, it could be both, all right? Okay, y'all gonna need getting money with y'all with y'all new love, all right? Because you got an ending coming to all of this sadness and sorrow, nine of swords energy, okay? This could be how you have been feeling, Libra. Maybe you have been in your head. Maybe you have been, um, you know, just worried about something, very anxious about something. And I feel like it could be about your love life with this lover's card here. But I do feel like that is what's coming to an ending here, okay? Because you got the lover's card to the nine of coins, okay? With the knights of coins. I just feel like something that felt like it was about, it was, you know, happening slow, whether this is like financial, whether this is about your business or whether this is about your love life, okay? Whatever, one, two, three, four on the timer, all right? Something is progressing. It's taking off because I was just about to say, if you felt like something had been slowed down or stagnant for a while, however, this message is resonating with you, things are about to start picking up for you. Your manifestations are about to start coming into fruition. You're about to start seeing the rewards of your ben um, of your labor and things like that. Things are about to be taken off for you. And I feel like in your love life and your freaking financial life, and your career, things are about to be... Hold on, Libra. He ain't the cups on the split. Y'all better hold on. Y'all better strap in, put your seatbelt on, okay? Child. And this could be a secret. Like, this This is... Mm, something that you've been fighting for or, or this has been a secret from you or something like that. Maybe the universe is keeping it a secret from you that this person was coming in or that this these... Things were about to take off for you or something like that. I don't know. Tell me about this King of Coins. How's this King of Coins coming to our Libra? What's this King of Coins? Ooh, shit now. Whew. All right. So I picked the Knight of Swords up in the in the reverse, child. Aquarius energy. Knight of Swords. This talks about some fast communication coming in. Okay, the Knight of Swords in the upright talks about fast communication, something coming in fast. But it's in, but with it being in the reverse, I feel like it's, it's slow. Mm, somebody's holding back. Whoever this King of Coins is, they're holding back. Maybe they're like trying to carefully plan what to do or what to say or how to approach you or something like that. Tell me more. What this King of Swords? How's the how they come into our Libra? King of Swords. I mean King of Coins. I'm sorry. How this King of Coins come into our Libra? Jumping on top of the Queen of Coins. Three of Cups. 
All right, let's see. What is this? Yeah, something's a secret. Holding back their damn emotions. <laughs> So, all right. So, I feel like this person is going to come toward you um, as if this is a business opportunity, okay? And again, like I said, it very well could be. Maybe they want to, like I said, bring you into a group um, or something like that. Maybe there's a group of people who's trying to do something and they this person wants to bring you in here, all right? But it's almost like... <sighs> This is a little confusing here. Because it's almost like this person, they're holding back emotions. Like, they don't want to come toward you with a love offer right off the jump, right? Whoever this is, they don't want to come towards you with a love offer right off the jump, 1606. And maybe in the beginning, it'll be all about business. But maybe the more that you start to talk to this person and get to know this person and work with this person, 1616 on the timer, then it, it turns in to something else here, okay? So it could be like that type of situation, all right? Because maybe this person is doing some healing right now, or maybe they, they know that you're doing some healing, or maybe you guys going to be healing each other because you have the three of cups, three of swords out here. And the three of swords talks about the heartbreak and all of that stuff, but you got the strength card with the hermit out here. So it's like you guys are going to something unexpected, like whatever this connection starts out to be is gonna turn into something unexpected like you're not gonna expect this person to have the effect on you that they will okay oh, and and or vice versa I feel like it's gonna be a two-way street like a business opportunity or something like that could turn into something else could turn into some type of healing this also if just say that you are like a reader Okay, I'm using that as an example. That's not what that doesn't be what ugh, that doesn't have to be what you do. Okay, in order for you to resonate with this, but I'm just saying, even if just say you are a reader and this person comes to you, like maybe they get a reading from you, or uh, maybe they seek some type of spiritual counseling from you, like um, some type of healing or something like that. It's like you're helping this person to heal, but in the meat, but also it's like. I don't know, one or both of you is like catching feelings in the, in the process. Hmm, that's interesting. Yeah, the magician, top of the deck. Yeah, this, is, this could be what you've been manifesting. This is something to do with your manifestations or this person's manifestations. And again, this could just be somebody, like if you have a platform, whatever it is that you do, it's, this could just be somebody who watches you. But I'm not getting like any weird ass, stalking ass energy <laughs> from this. So don't be alarmed with that. I'm not getting that from this. Yeah, I'm not getting that from this. Hmm. This is that's interesting okay hold on let me move this um shit they're making me want to pull some love oracles on this because now i just want to be a little nosy let me just see if anything comes out here all right yeah look you got secret crush and soulmate. Tell me, um, didn't I say unexpected? Didn't I say this was going to be shocking to you? However this turns out, it's going to be real unexpected. Tell me about this King of Coins and Libra. What's, what? Just tell me, whatever, what, whatever comes out. Tell me about this King of Coins and Libra. Child. 
storm warning came out and this is the tower energy but it came out in the reverse so healing no blockages being removed okay this is not a tower moment this is a tower being rebuilt honey this is no drama this is no obstacles blockages being removed here i'm telling you you may be helping this person to heal and even if this person doesn't you may this person may be healing through watching you as well okay and they like developing like some type of secret crush on you or something like that tell me what's going on child they may take a chance honey Ooh, shit these cards popping out this person may take a risk they may roll the dice and go ahead and take a risk libra all right child i'm telling you y'all got some type of connection this person may be a soulmate or maybe they feel like you, they soulmate. I don't know. Uh, look at this. Look at this. This is going to be shocking to somebody. Oh, if y'all resonate with this, please let me know. Or if this happens, when it happens to you, <laughs> let me know. <coughs> this is going to be very, very shocking to somebody. Now, this, whatever this situation is, it could very well end up in an engagement with a proposal here, but, and it talks about wishes coming true, which is this nine of cups that's out here. This nine of cups talks about wish fulfillment. Okay. It does. All right. So you could be helping this person heal from some type of betrayal here. All right. But this could uh, just, this, this could, this could be an unexpected offer. Like maybe this person offers to like take you out on a date or something like that. Or like maybe this is just them asking for your number or something like that. But it's going to be real unexpected. Whoever this is, they live at a distance from you. Child, then you got wedding and single with new freaking love. Let me find out y'all meeting y'all soulmate. Look, the text messages I told y'all. Let me find out y'all meeting y'all soulmate online. I mean, like through a through a platform or something like that. This is crazy. But this is somebody on your level, though. Anything else? Let me not be greedy. Um, let's see if anything else comes out, though. Okay. All right. Mm -mm, nothing else. Look, child. Divine intervention and divine timing. All right, y'all. I. Something happened. If this person, whatever happened between you or this person, if somebody ghosted this person or ghosted you, I feel like that was divine intervention that was supposed to happen in order for you guys to meet up or whatever happened. Okay, whatever happened between you or whatever happened to them, whatever happened to you, whatever happened before you guys met or come into contact with each other, it's divine intervention. It's divine timing. Okay, it's, it's what's supposed to happen. All right. It's what's supposed to happen. Yeah. Child. I'm going I'm to leave that alone. I'm going to leave it alone. I really strongly feel like somebody who has two people who have a platform or who's in the public eye or something like that are going to come together. And it may start off as a business type deal. Okay. But I see two people coming together. And they're meeting by way of some type, something that somebody does for a living, something professional or something like that. Okay. I, I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to leave that right there. Um, I hope that helps somebody out. Somebody got something from this message. So until next time, I'm wishing y'all peace, love, prosperity, and abundance. All right. Bye.